Hey, well, it's been a while. Um, I'm uh, just starting. This is probably like my second or third video, probably. I don't know. I don't think I've uploaded one to YouTube yet. But uh, just to give everybody a, a view from Florida, this is what my backyard's looking like right now. And my little attack dog there with her brother. Oh, he must... Oh, there's nothing out there. Usually they go crazy over a rabbit or something, but yeah, there's nothing out there. But uh, yeah, this is the, this is what I'm working with right now. I'm not too mad about it. It's a good living right now. I wonder if he can swim if I chunk him in the pool. So, <clears throat> um, a lot's happened since the last time I made a video. Um my uh my son uh joined the army uh and on the day he shipped revealed that um he had a left-handed cigarette i threw a wrench all in my plans our plans were to uh move to the philippines next summer yeah, kind of throw a wrench on that. But, fortunately for him, it didn't totally screw him. He just lost the job that he wanted. Um, but, that well, was pretty cool right there, huh? Lost the job that he really, he was going to be a Black Hawk crew chief. Fly around in helicopters. So if he ever went to, like, to the field or something like that, he would, uh, <laughs> he'd fly. Now he gets to ride in the back of a vehicle. Kids are stupid nowadays. I admit, I got one of them. So, I keep trying to find my eyes on this thing. I think I got to look over here. So, uh, yeah, there we go. Um, so, anyways, uh, you know, I uh, made a mistake. 18 years old, made a dumb mistake. Two weeks before he was supposed to ship. So, we, uh, I'm going to set this up here. See if I can do this without hurting myself. Or dropping anybody. The dogs are going crazy. Right, there we go. As long as I'll fall in the pool. There we go. Alright. So yeah. So he uh he went he decided oh, I don't want to do active duty. I want to do reserves. Fine. Do reserves. Go to college. So that's where we're at with that. Um my wife and I we have decided no matter what we're going to the Philippines. We are moving to the Philippines next oh. summer, COVID permitting. Um, so I will let this blind dog in. Um, so moving to the Philippines next summer um, and COVID permitting and everything of that sort, we will be there. So come on, Ringo. I got a, a really, that's a blind dog. About was blind. He's about seven. He's about eighteen years old. Can't hear. Can't see. Can't do nothing. So he, he barks at his own shadow. And uh, but anyways. Um, so yeah. So next summer um, we are moving to the Philippines. We have decided that we are. We don't know where. Um, toss up between um, uh, up north where she's from in Baguio um, or down south I don't know like Cebu or Dumaguete um, we try to stay away from Manila maybe uh, Leyte never know hey get so um, but we don't know we want to go this like September October to sort of see um, maybe, you know, see how it is, um, get a, an idea of what we're looking at while we're doing it, what it all entails. I've already got, I've already done a little bit of research on how to ship our dog. It's pretty simple. Um, I've already got all the shots. I just pay them money. They come pick her up, the little white one. Um, my son's going to keep the, the, the little pit and, um, which is good. 
because the little one travels well. So um, we're going to um, take her with us. And uh, yeah, it's pretty simple. We fill out all the paperwork, give them a deposit. They come pick her up, take her down. And we see her on the other side of the pond. Um, but, uh, <laughs> you know, I, I really hope that uh, this COVID thing will get over. Um, I'm in Florida. We don't wear masks. We, um, my wife and I are fully vaccinated. Um, so we do not, uh, we are not required to wear masks or social distance or anything like that here. Um, but it's fine. Um, you know, we know that you got to play the game. You know, we learned it while we were in the military. You got to play the game and get there. Um, hey, do me a favor before I forget, like um, this video, subscribe, turn on that notification. So when I do another video, which hopefully I'm trying to, do, I'm gonna start doing one about once a week. Um, the next one I'm gonna try to do is on things that you probably have to do prior to moving um, to the Philippines. Um, right now, there's a lot of visas. There's, um, you know, you gotta, like I turn 50 next year. So I qualify for the SRRV visa. Um, I'm not gonna do it, um, not right away. Um, and because I'm a veteran, it's only $1,500. Um, I only gotta pay $1,500 or show, or have $1,500 in my account, I believe it is. I'm gonna do a whole segment on that next, um, the next video or in the future um, on the special visas and how to do it. Um, I was in the military, it's, I'm very, black and white show me what i need and i will execute and make it happen whether it be i-130s or anything of that sort everything that is done um, i had no problems um, when my wife came to the states became a, a green card holder joined the military now she's a u.s citizen then i filed all the paperwork for her to get her dual citizenship back because she wanted a security clearance while she was in the army i don't know what the well, whatever so happy wife happy life um so now she's a dual citizen um, that entailed us flying up to washington dc um, and um, getting her dual citizenship back now we can own land we can own a house and i can go because she's a citizen again so um you know but our our long our short term is get through this next year um, enjoy this florida weather um we've already started hitting phase lines on um, things that we have to do, things that we want to do um, in order to move there. Um, our son threw a wrench in one of them, so it kind of reset up one of the, one of the objectives. But we will, um, we will definitely, man, it's getting dark quick out here. <laughs> Let me go sit underneath the thing where there's a little bit of light. You know, I always said, you know, when God said, uh, let there be light, he made me. So, hold on just one second. Put this up. I got my horses running. <laughs> I love what you're doing. There we go. Ah, much better. Yeah, I'm just gonna, just gonna sit over here and use the old wife's paper clip while I talk to you guys. Um, so, yeah, no, probably not. All right, so we're going to put you up on Bob. This is Bob. Me and Bob, we get along very well. My wife and him don't get along very well. She beats him up religiously every day. Um, it's our little kicking buddy. Uh, yeah, so we're both, my wife and I are both black belts. We train. We're going to a tournament next weekend. So, but by moving to the Philippines, we are going to give all that up. So... Um, but like I said, um, we're gonna, I'm gonna do, I think I do a videos, a few videos on how to get there, what's the steps to get there, and then also, um, having, uh, you know, the expenses, of course, a budget, you, know, you gotta have that, I don't like that, um, you know, having a budget, um, what do you do with your house, do you rent your house, do you not rent your house, that type of stuff. Um, do you sell your house? Do you sell everything and then move um, to the brick and mortar? I don't know. We're not selling. We're renting. We're renting our stuff out um, so we can keep it 
So we can come back to this anytime we want. Oh yeah, the lights lit up finally, you know. Um, you know, we just, um, things here in the States are just not what they used to be. Um, they used to be um, cheap, <laughs> is one way of doing it, but not anymore. So anyways, uh, I just want to pop on here real quick, let everyone know that next summer we are moving to the Philippines and I will be trying to document almost everything I can. Um, once again, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Let's grow this channel and then uh, ring the bell. That way, whenever I, <laughs> my ugly mug gets back on there, you'll be able to see me and um, hopefully give you some information that you might not already know. All right. All right. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.